Are pawn and game is basically the same thing. So, do you game at all? Uh, so, basically, um, I used to play PUBG during lockdown on my phone. Right. I was actually really good at that. Uh, and I play Animal Crossing on my Switch. That's really as much as I'm dipping my toes in. I, I played Animal Crossing <clears throat> during lockdown. It's great. It's a good game. It's I haven't zen. played it for a while, but, you know, I, got, no, I feel yeah, like same. I was trading onions or what what do you try oh what my god trade? or like rocks i used to sneak into my friend's towns get some wood get some yeah. rocks someone someone bought me my friend meg who i'm actually friends with Shout now out. she during lockdown had hadn't met her properly before right but she delivered me a witch's hat and i really appreciate that's the that. symbol of friendship that yeah you can't ever fall out exactly well you might but for no reason she was like you're the witch so i'm just gonna <laughs> she literally came to my island gave me a witch's hat and Thank disappeared you. i'm jealous all i got was rocks I'm dead. I'll work on my friends. Yeah, yeah exactly. Them. Have you ever played The Sims? Uh, the Sims. The I've Sims. Literally, I used to, but then I just got a bit bored because I'd just like, I'd make them shag and I think that's funny. And I'd be like, well, what's the point? Have you ever heard of a mod called Wicked Whims on The Sims? No. Right. What's a mod? So like they're like modifications to the game. Right. So people can make them and then you download them yourself and put them in the game and it just changes the gameplay. So oh. you can get one um, that is, I have one where they can be strippers and really? they can- uh, GTA vibes. Yeah, That's literally. how I learned what strip club was. What, from GTA? Yeah, when I was really young, my brother had it and I was like, oh, what's this? And I saw tits and I was like, oh, I love this place. <laughs> what you, was at San Andreas? Yeah, 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 yeah. Great I'm game. Say, yeah, but yeah. Love it. Thanks. But yeah, so there's this Wicked Whims mod in The Sims, right? right. And in The Sims, they woohoo, which is their version of just sleeping together. <laughs> woohoo. Woo and in this mod, that makes it really realistic. And it's really, really weird. Yeah. Like, and they can the have periods. They have like a um, ovulation cycle. What a niche thing to do though, yeah. surely. You can have like, miscarriages you can oh, nice. get abortions Love selling that. it to me yeah america's crying Love yeah. that. Wow. <laughs> all of the realism and this is why <laughs> yeah. this is my version of the sims no, i just download, download it. loads of mods Fine. but i have a it's called gk react because i was in a rush and i couldn't think of anything else to call it but i've got a load of news stories from the gaming world right and i feel like it's going to be funny if you react to them because okay. they're a little bit you know obscure right Let's be honest. So I'm the scared. first one, and I think I've mentioned this uh, to Ovi when he came on the podcast, is about, so a Mario Tennis launch. So there's obviously Mario. Oh, right. Yeah, Mario. Yeah. And he's got a brother called Luigi. He does. Who's like the taller one. He always wears green. Infamous. And um, when the footage from Mario Tennis Aces dropped, people became obsessed with Luigi because in the photo he has a bulge. And I'll show you here. It's kind of around this, you know, this I'm area. You've got to bring that closer. Um, I don't know if you can see, but on Luigi's shorts, oh, no, there does. is, he's, he's doing like a, a tennis swing, right? And he's Why got a bulge. a bulge. And the article here says, have you ever pondered the size of Luigi's dick? <laughs> also. Neither have we, but um, the artwork suggests that he does have a bulge. And then people were debating on Reddit how big you know, Luigi's... I think he gives off massive cock energy. BDE. BDE, yeah. yeah. Like, Mario would have a small one because he's kind of short, kind of like a bit tubby. But Luigi would have a big one. Really? 100%. I've, Does the bulge I'm thinking look big? more like... Um, who's the other characters? Like Wario or... Or no, they'd have tiny ones. It's like, you know when you sleep with muscly men and they always have really disappointing... No, am I allowed to say this on? Is this a tough podcast? Yeah, you can. Okay. Yeah, they always have really tiny penises. <laughs> Whereas if you sleep with slimmer, tall men, schlongs. Okay, so yeah. you think Luigi would have one? I'm team Luigi. They've estimated, and bearing in mind they're like cartoons, so it might naturally be a bit <laughs> yeah. smaller. So the verdict was it's about 3.7 inches, and then in brackets it says soft. So, you know. Well, maybe he's a grower as well. Yeah, it could be if that's soft. I'm impressed. But I mean, people really have time to be like the fact that they've estimated it is yeah is a lot i know and i wonder how they came to that conclusion like we are don't they... have the scientific breakdown well, on he's italian isn't he yes so maybe they're looking at the population of italy average size of men there 
take a few inches off the height Bob's your uncle, Luigi Chicoc. There we go. Yeah, nice. <laughs> right, the second one is um, kidnapper got trade. Well, someone got Sorry, kidnapped. I didn't mean to laugh. I was like, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> someone got <clears throat> kidnapped, yeah. um, and they traded their victim for what well, the kidnapper traded the victim for an Xbox 360. You'd be so offended, wouldn't you? Yeah, I would. Is that all I'm worth? Have you ever seen those memes? It's like someone gets kidnapped and then they're up in the back seat, like, so where are we going to? <laughs> yeah. Like, what music are we going to play? I feel like <laughs> that's that would... so. Although, happy to be free though, do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's true. So basically, a man recently kidnapped his employee. Oh. Who happens to be his son-in-law. So this is where it gets a bit complicated. Friend of an op is an op, yeah. Yeah, because I feel like if you get, like, if, if kidnapped by your father-in-law, it's like, well, you know them. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, not... what are we going to do about that? Anyway, um, he kidnapped him because he thought he stole $245 worth of rings. So that's why he got kidnapped. Right. Um, but he finally set him free back. in exchange for a neighbor's Xbox 360. Those rings must have been, wait, how much rings? $245 worth of rings. And how much is an Xbox? I don't know how much it would have been back in the day. I reckon about 200. I reckon he made some interest on that. I, I reckon he made a little bit of profit. Yeah, fine. They, they captured him, yeah, by telling him they needed to move, well, they needed help moving a saw. And then they kidnapped him. They took the younger man into a room, locked the door, and kidnapped him. Basically. Or you couldn't get married after that, could you? That is your father-in-law. Yeah. You'd have to end it quick. That's awkward. That's really awkward. What would you, you say You probably have to vows? see them because it says they, they're an employee as well. So do you reckon they just went back to normal after that? Like, oh, thanks for letting me free. I'd contact my union, 100%. Do you reckon they have a union? Yeah, fuck knows. Or if they're kidnapping. That's I don't, the, I don't, I don't reckon they have a, a union, to be honest with you. Right. <laughs> the next one is... Right. A gamer's death at an internet internet cafe goes... I don't know why I laughed. It's because I, <laughs> yeah. I messed up. It's really not because someone died. Rest in peace, yeah. A gamer's death at an internet cafe goes unnoticed for nine hours. So... Um, the game, literally. Yeah, exactly. So apparently someone, a gamer, um, had yeah. basically died, I guess, playing league of legends Intense, on this yeah. and literally no one noticed there's people in the same because it's because he passed away like in the position gaming how do like, you play league upright. of legends legends how do you play <laughs> league of legends like that is it on, like, it's on a, a computer console? no it'd be on a computer oh, well, yeah but I mean, my thing is he must have passed away very peacefully he died doing what he loved i know and that's not what many people could say it's true that is so embarrassing <laughs> And you're just there. He's stiff by the time they found him. Do you reckon he felt ill or anything? Maybe the stress really got him. Maybe he had an aneurysm. I've nearly done that while driving. What, has an aneurysm? Yeah. Sometimes I get pain in my eye if right. I get really stressed. Then I've Googled it and apparently that can be serious. Do you wear glasses? Yeah. Were you wearing glasses no. at the time? Oh. <laughs> Sometimes I get really you know bad what? headache. That's, yeah, that's a great point actually. When yeah. I'm driving. Do you wear glasses? Yeah. Do you? I do. I'm meant to wear them all the time, actually. Same. Mm. Fuck that. And then when I get to something like a football game and I literally, like, the players are so far away and I'm like, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, I squint really bad. I'm like... Yeah. And then I put glasses on and my eyes relax. And I'm like, oh, this is what it's like. It's life changing. When you put your glasses on, you're like, oh, oh, this is what it's meant to look like. Yeah. And then I take them off and then... And then I just get used to it again. Yeah. Felt that. you got to get through life. Blind these ways. the blind. What can you do? Okay, are porn and game it's basically the same thing? This is what an article has asked. The argument is basically that um, they, I mean, I, I guess they're just saying porn and gaming are quite addictive and they're both oh, online. right, okay. So that's what they're saying. They're not literally saying... Is Fortnite... Unless you have the Wicked Whims mod, I guess. Start porn, then, yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. Tell them. Um, the article actually went to, on to acknowledge that games and porn are actually different, but it's just the fact that you could be addicted to both of them and they're ruining basically the upbringing of children, I think is what the argument was meant to say. I mean, I've never been addicted to either, really. 